Hello there. I've got someone here I'd like you all to meet. This is Pooh Bear. He doesn't belong to me, but he's been in my family for nearly 40 years. He used to be bright, happy poo orange all over, and he had a sweet little red shirt. But clearly, he's been very loved. Too loved for someone new to enjoy. And from what the Toy Story sequels have taught me, I don't think he loves being kept on a shelf. <coughs> all lonely and gathering dust. Wheezy? Is that you? Hey, Woody. And of course, you know, I get it. It's reasonable to not want a bunch of stuff around that has no use. But when I heard that this poor sweet boy, who has been a loyal companion for so many years, was taken from his shelf and unceremoniously chucked into the trash, I just couldn't stand for it. I told her to get him the hell out of there. You're a monster! Now, to be clear, I don't want him. But I thought... What if I made Poo into something useful for an adult human person? Like what? That way, she could keep him, and he'd be loved and be appreciated every day. So that's got me thinking. I do have this old Hummel lamp. Oh yeah, she's a collectible. Oh, ugh, mother. Its shade is in dire need of repair. And don't you think Poo would be an adorable little lampshade? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> I've definitely never attempted to make a lampshade before, so it's going to be a learning experience. But I don't know. Seems pretty straightforward to me. I'd love to be able to just repair the original lampshade, but it's so old the plastic is cracking up at the slightest touch. So I'm just gonna take it apart and make a new one. I think I'll use this random mysterious sheet of plastic that's been hanging around in my craft bin for a time. Hopefully it'll work. I don't know. We'll see. I want to use the old shade as a pattern. So I have to go against my nature and work delicately here so as to not destroy it. First thing, I need to remove the metal rings. Oh! Alright! You got a ring! Oh my god, this old shit that's like flaking in my mouth. Got it! Ta da! Alright, now I have to try to slice this open. Gently. Oh, that's like shattering. Oh, oh, okay. Yep. All right, that went pretty well. Just grab some parchment off the roll to get started on making the pattern. I just wasted my time. I'm gonna need this to be on something stiffer, so random cardboard junk it is. I'm not feeling great about this part, safety-wise. I just get the feeling I'm not gonna come out of this unscathed. I'm putting my fingies on the line. That turned out all right. Woo! <laughs> that went better than expected. And now I'm gonna shoddily stitch these linen scraps together. This fabric will act as a canvas, I suppose, to which I will attach a flattened poo.
All right, Pooh, your time has come. Oh my God, I feel so bad about this. I'm gonna carefully take out his stitches at the back and start removing his stuffing. used to be so bright and beautiful. Here's the evidence. Too much love got you looking haggard. Oh, he's made of weird stuff. <laughs> I don't like what is inside you, sir. I don't like it at all. Have you ever wondered what fluff and stuff looks like in real life? <laughs> oh my god. It's so orange. Apparently, it's not a pretty sight. Oh. Ew, this was like hard. It looks like like honeycomb candy. Honeycomb candy, huh? Yeah, that checks out. Oh me? Oh my! Is this what happens to your insides if you maintain a honey-only diet for a few decades? He's like full. Of, yeah, I don't like this. I don't like what's in here. Oh come on, this is so nasty. Why are there so many hard pieces? Look at this one. Oh my god, I'm so grossed out. No wonder she put you in the trash. It looks like it's made out of real nacho cheese. My god, the fluff and stuff is never ending. Oh my god. Time to just reverse him to get all this out. This is so wrong. I, 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 I'm gonna inhale this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, you gotta see me wide. Um, it's fucking carnage. Look at this shit. This is fucked up. I don't like this. This is fucked up. <laughs> I didn't expect it to be like this. Oh my god, Pooh Bear. Oh my god. Are you seeing all this ultra-fine Cheeto powder floating off into the air? And directly into my lungs. All right, here comes the head. This <laughs> is so upsetting. This is so fucked up. Look at his face. Oh my god. Oh my god. What was I thinking doing this? I thought it would be fun. I don't think this is fun. Oh no. Oh no. Pooh bear. You poor, poor bear. Oh my god. You're so cute and disgusting. Holy shit. Okay. Okay. You're good. I'll be doing this for a while. <laughs> I can't take it. What a handsome boy, huh? To get the coverage I need to make poo into an entire lampshade, I'm gonna need to disassemble his, um, hide? Sorry, Pooh. He's got a lot more to clean up. But let's begin.
lovely little guy. <clears throat> and here's his body parts. Time for the head. You're up. Oh no. Oh, just what precisely is it that you are doing exactly? Unfortunately, it looks like I'm gonna have to split open his face. You're not flat enough, Pooh. It's not gonna work. Why, well, you've become quite good at this. All done. And now I present to you Pooh's parts. We got some legs. A couple of arms. Some more legs. And his head. Oh my! Now I gotta sort out the layout. I was hoping not to cut these pieces, but it's, it's not gonna happen. All right, so now that we've got this all laid out, we're gonna stitch them back together. I figure it'll be best to really reinforce the edges with a nice, big, strong stitch. Yes, strength of seams. That is most definitely my only motivation for adding this stitch. I promise. And that about does it. But one more addition to the face. I think he's all ready. Looking good. Felt very confident up until this point. And now we're getting to the part where I really do not know what I'm doing. <laughs> it's fucking terrifying. <laughs> the face is jacked up. I don't like it. Normally I hate spending money on my stupid crafts, but who bear his family? I don't want to get this right. So I spent way too much money on glue. I have no idea what glue I want. I got some lot of shit. I don't know what I'm doing. So I think I want to try this stuff, but I don't know. I am very excited having found this UV activated super glue. Light activated. Does this work? Oh, that's exciting. Oh boy, that's okay, okay. Oh, it's a lot of fucking glue. Oh my god, this is fucking magic. Gush, gush. Oh, it's so hot, it's scaring me. Okay. Done. Okay, so now we're gonna try to use this fabric glue. Fabric, fabric tape. Permanent, double-sided fabric tape. I love instructions so much. Um, oh. Let's put this, like, here? 
Is that cool? Are we good? Do I want to use this one? Cancer! 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 Oh, fuck. Oh. 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 Okay. So there's that. Oh. Oh, fuck. Right. Now comes the hard part. This is going to be a crapshoot from here on out. Uh, oh, okay. Well. I'm going to throw this cancer glue on here now, too. Just throw some more glue at it. I don't know. To see what sticks. <laughs> Hey -o. Oh, here comes the eye irritation that was promised. Things were starting off pretty positive, you know, my UV light glue. The tape was working great, but now things are starting to go downhill. First, when I didn't put the metal ring in before I started gluing it down. Is this like, right? No! 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 Oh, shit. I forgot this. We're doing so good. So good. You in there, bitch? And then I really started to unravel when I did the exact same thing on the bottom row. Oh, this is so dumb. Oh my god! Ah! Holy shit. No! Fuck. Fuck! I'm having zero fun right now. Oh my god. This sucks so fucking hard. Fucking clue what I'm doing. Fuck everything and everyone. Cut it. Pull it out. I don't care. Fuck! What a fucking disaster. All better now. Okay, fuck off. All right, folks. That is how not to make a lampshade. But we shall push on. Finishing off the edges. She just love the warm glow emanating from the sweet boy before she goes to bed at night. I'm charmed. Time to bring you home to your mama. Safety first, buddy. All right. She's just gonna love you. All right, here it is. What the fuck? <laughs> fuck that shit. No. <laughs> oh well, guess you're mine now, Pooh. You'll fit in beautifully in my house. <laughs>